Knacker. <laughs> I think that's a word for him. It's a baby. <laughs> hey, what's going on, guys? Hope you're doing awesome, possum. Welcome back to Amnesia Rebirth, episode three. All right, we're back on the surface. And it appears maybe the sun's going down or maybe it's coming up. I'm really not sure how long I was underground for. God in heaven, Sergei. Look where we are. What am I going to do? Just look at me. Hold down X to check in on your baby. I can't believe I forgot this. Yeah, you just... Just casually forget you're pregnant, you know? No problem. The child, like he said. Find the others. Get home. Both of us. So you can check in on your baby at any time. I mean, it is kind of important, I guess, you know? Dude, we are getting big. Alright, let's use our beefy lady arms to move this big old piece of stone. Is that no matches? Bummer. Ooh, we got some sort of structure. There, that building. Oh god, we were so close. The reminders tab of your sketchbook. Press J shows your current objective. To get to the building. Who would have known? <laughs> Cobain's baby. I hope Hank and the others are inside that place. Or Ugh. someone. But at any rate. Creepy sound effect. <laughs> Dude, I'm so tempted to jump off this. You know, there's a word in French. At least I've heard that there's a word in French for that feeling that you sometimes get when you're at the top of a really high place and you just have this weird unnatural urge to just jump off like it's it's not suicidal there's actually a word for this it's weird and i've definitely had that feeling before and then you're like why am i feeling like this really weird i should look that up kind of curious what that word is crouching yeah i already know about crouching but it says before dropping down a ledge oh it'll dampen your fall didn't know that never mind getting ahead of myself oh cool baby should i do it I'm thinking about it. I kind of want to see what happens. But no, 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 that's crazy talk, man. We got a baby. Can't be, can't be killing ourselves when we got a baby. All right. Mala, do you know her? The statue? I'm from Sudan, Mr. Sterling. This is Algeria. It might be Tin Hinan, the mother of the Tuareg. It's a strange style, though. It is indeed. Quite strange. Uh, so we can light that bad boy on fire. We got more meches? Wait, what is that? Like a little torch? Okay, maybe there's somewhere else I gotta go. Indeed there is. Indeed there is. It's not a friendly supply, is it? Count your lucky stars, old chap. You could have come down in the middle of nowhere. Don't worry, Jonathan. Supplies, water, a map, there'll be something. Even if there's no one home. Lycos would have gathered the plies. Bet you. Bet you. Boy. Looks like they went up there. Oh, can we break that down now? Oh, can we? Oh, we can't open it. We can jiggle it a little bit now. Bloody hell, mate. And I'm all preggers, or else I would just uh, climb up there and jump over, but uh, we got a baby in the oven, so might not be the... Ooh. Might not be the best idea. Can we break this off? Oh, yeah, dude. There's that super pregnant lady strength. <laughs> All right, we can probably crank this open, right? Move the mouse in circles while holding. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
we've done it. Looks like a nice lady. What the fudge is this? Looks like some kind of cipher for something. Or it's just a log of some sort. Pretty weird. I wonder if I'll need that later on. Is that in my uh, in my notes? It's not. Interesting. I almost wonder if I should write this down. So, before I go up there, should we go see what's up here? Look for some more matches. Dude, it's still super dark up here, man. No matches, really? I feel gypped. All right, anyway. Uh, and there, Hakim recounted the tale of the local tribe, the Kelhanan. They were a Tureg that refused the call to Islam for their own ancestor, Tin Hanan, a bringer of healing and fertility. Walked to the sand, and how should they disbelieve the evidence of their own eyes? There was fighting, as there always is in such matters. But the Kelhanan were wealthy and made their peace through trade in salt and meat. Yes, yeah, salt and meat. Definitely a good currency. Well. Bound to be matches in one of these, right? Oh, yeah, baby. Score. We got two of them. Looks like there used to be stairs here. And then, uh... The cliffs collapsed, I guess. All right, anyway, let's go through that gate that we unlocked. Open sesame. Not far. How's the baby doing? Doing just fine, I guess. What's up, homie? What in God's name? I've... I've seen that thing before. I'm sure I have. Fuck. I wish I could remember. She's a little bit of a potty mouth. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Jonathan Weber. He's an engineer. Papers? British? We'll need a visa. Travel from Croydon with us. Jonathan is the engineer, another triple crown hire, met in London. Has worked on a ton of projects, but never outside of good old England. Nice guy, but like an excited puppy. Desperate to have a proper taste of Africa. He'll work well with Tossie and Eva, but we need to make sure Leon doesn't steamroller him. Nice. We're learning. Oh, Jonathan's great. First time out in the world, and everything's a wonder. It's like having a kid along. Oh, jeez. Sorry, Tessie. So insensitive. Welcome to the end of the world. Hey, thanks. What a nice greeting. Malik, Leon, let's take a look ahead. The rest of you, hold tight here. Won't be long. Tazi, what's the sign say? My French is piss poor. <laughs> just, um, just that they were a long way from home. All right, let's head on inside if we can. <laughs> Precious jewel, and look at you. <laughs> Oh, 
we were here. I, I remember being scared. Why? Yeah, this place looks badass. Dude, that'd be so cool to go to one of these places in real life. Look at the size of this place. Look at it, mate. It's bloody gigantic. Alright, well, I mean, where to first? Oh, there's a tank? Ooh, baby. Yeah, they were, uh, they were definitely at war. That's the doctor. Oh, you can climb in? We can play army man. Ooh. Dude, can I load a shell in here? That was a dead dude. What's up, homie? How you doing, bud? That was a key. Okay, we got a key. And dude, you can totally move this whole turret around. That's crazy. Do we have shells in here? Oil can be used to refill your lantern. Nice. Okay, so we gotta find a shell. And then we can eventually blow something open. Pretty badass. Alright, let's, uh, let's get out of here. Go see if we can uh, find that radio that the doctor was calling on. Okay, there's a light right here. I'm guessing that's a clue I gotta go in this building right here. Unless the radio was inside the tank. I'm here. I'll always be here. What a, what a good mom. Don't stop talking, Doctor. We've got to get to that radio. Door's locked. Oh, I need to get in there. Got some more oil. God, it's Hello. so hard to see. Just keep talking, Doctor. Keep talking. Keep talking, I'll Doctor. Keep talking. Keep talking. Yes. Oh, you can lean? Oh, baby! So how do we refill the lantern? With left? Okay, cool, 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 cool. an elevator. Ooh. Oh, I could have lit that if I was paying attention. Could I get into the radio room from above somehow? <sighs> oh, I missed another one, dang it. <laughs> Alright, so we got quite a few things lit, so I'm feeling pretty good. Let's go ahead and read this. So it's the winch for the elevator, it says. Spring arm, bed frame, question mark. Uh, lathe, treadmill, sturdy frame, bench, winch from elevator. So we have to find those parts? A spring arm from a bed frame? Or are they talking about they made, they made the winch out of those things? Huh. Odd. All right. It's 
Spirky, mat. Spirky. Boom, baby. Oh, I was gonna get. I was about to get that one. Trying to look for more matches. I know there's three more matches right at the opening of this place. What's going on here? Uh oh, something blew that out. And she's scared for some reason? Uh, Mama, please talk to Papa for me. Please, he has not replied to my letters. This is no place for me. The men are cruel, and the land is cruel. I beg of you, I beg of him. I will do everything, anything, to make amends. If he will not take pity, ask if he truly wants the family, the family name to die out here in the dust. Matthew. Okay. All right, should we take our lantern out? Matches, baby. That's what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm doing right now. I'm trying to get to that radio, but uh, I think it's kind of far away. How many do we got? We still got eight out of ten matches. We're doing great. No problem. Matches for days. Get his doors locked. The dead body. Christ's name. Poor dude. Oh, we got something right here. Something glowing. So what was that? Oh, that's the winch. Okay, cool, 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 cool. <sighs> Doors locked. This is stuck solid. Got some oil. Beautiful. Damn it, I've got to reach that radio somehow. I remember. I know, baby. Don't worry about it. We getting there. Getting there. Dang, oil runs out fast, man. All right, you know, I'm just not even gonna use it. This area doesn't even really seem like an issue. Matches? Yeah, baby. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll go to the left. Get that out of the way. Eh. I was trying to light that, but I couldn't quite get to it in time. Got a note here. Uh, Jin of the Inner Desert, gathered by Luciano of Ravina. Uh, the Ifrit is a Jinny, I don't know how to say that, of fire and flame, a vengeance called upon a murderer, implacable, unstoppable, the death of cities. It rises from desolation, from broken lands, and its sign is a shining light. Uh, it scents the vitality of its victim and seizes them with its burning eye until all life is drained. As a spider husks a fly. A uh, dua a la masala. A prayer of asking and true penance is the only difference. So is that the monster that's probably in this area hunting me? Okay, man, we got flames for days. The Ashen Mother is a genie of healing, of succor in the wilderness. Uh, she is wild and 
capricious. She cannot be summoned, but if her sympathy is roused, she may choose to bestow her favor, giving of her body to quench the thirst of the dying and guiding those who wander in the soft places. Sounds like a nice lady. Oops. Uh, the Hatif is a genie of calling, the voice alone in the desert, the cry of one bereft and in need of aid. Yet this voice is bodiless and unfleshed. Spun of air and dreams, it assails the weary and the beleaguered, luring them from their path and into the wilderness. There may, or there they may search in vain, lost and thirsty until they are bone and dust. Oh my God. Yasmin. So she's still alive? Or they're calling from beyond the grave? Who knows? Oh, matches. Yeah, baby. Uh, we got 9 out of 10. Matches for days. Okay, so can we put that winch thingy right here? For the rope so we can wind it? Sure can. Uh, move the mouse in circles while holding to wheel to turn up. Okay, that didn't. Oh, so we need a floorboard so we can stand on, right? So it said a bed frame, right? We got the winch. We need a sturdy frame from a bench and a spring arm from a bed frame or whatever. Okay, 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 okay. There's a hole. Getting spooky. Come on, get! You think that? Oh my! There's so many pillows, man. I was gonna say, do you think there's any uh, matches under the pillows? But look like we couldn't move them. Okay, we got a piece of paper. The Kel Hanan talk of their guardian spirit, or perhaps the word is goddess, a woman all in gray, who haunts the desert and protects their people against the specter of death. They call her Tihanu, and leave her gifts of desert flowers. Nice. Nice. thing I looked in here. I think it's oil. Yeah, baby. How's that baby doing? I've got to find a way to the radio. Still heart beating away. Okay, so we gotta be looking for the bed frame thing. And the bench. Hmm. Am I supposed to be scared in this area? Because I feel completely safe. Okay, we got another note. I don't think I read this one. Dust and desert, arid plain, I dream of you, I call your name. A flower blooms, the petals fall. Sand glass empties, still I call. Ten years gone, my time is done. A journey home, my battle's won. There's no one waiting, no one there, just echoes in an empty chair. Yeah, I like that. I dig it. I dig it, dog. Yeah, maybe the other parts are in different buildings, I'm really not sure. Oh wait, there's, there's something back here. We got matches. And we got another uh, visa paper or like description of this guy. Dr. Anton Metzier. Uh, he's Swiss. Uh, Sterling Sr. insisted we have a doctor on the expedition because his people don't trust the locals. Told him this was a week at K's, not three months in the jungle, but he wouldn't hear it. Uh, so they sent us this guy. Don't know much about him, but they uh, must be paying him a lot to leave a practice in Switzerland. Guess he's competent. Whether he can cope with Africa, we'll see. Oh, the doc? Yeah, he seems okay. Between you and me, I think he's a drinker. Maybe they sent him out here to dry out. Ooh. Dry out. Alright, well, I think that was 
pretty much it. You know, part of me wonders if I can jump up there. Like, if I were to drag a barrel over here. That'd be, it feels like that'd be so much work, though, right? Oh! We're doing it! I don't think there's anything up there, though. I'm stuck. I am stuck. I broke the game. I'm stuck. <laughs> oh no. I'm so sorry. No, get out. You can do this. You can do this. You can get out. Come on. Well, this sucks. Big bummer. <laughs> Look, I'm not I'm not even touching anything. She's freaking out, dude. What if I save and exit? What if I save and exit and load it back up? Will it load me at like a, a better position? Okay, cry. Oh no! Uh oh. Guys, I don't know what to do. Yeah, things are getting spooky. Okay, <laughs> okay. Here we go. Maybe I can't die from this. Is this just supposed to be scary? Oh, we can load game. Hold up. Oh, okay. We can load from like six minutes ago. Hopefully that's before I was stuck. Okay, so there is a... I just didn't know that was there. Okay. Good, 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 good. Well, that was the scariest part of the game so far. Oh, no! I've been here for like six minutes. Are you... Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I've been there for that long? Oh no, that's so- that's 20 minutes ago, guys! Oh. It's like the whole episode, man. Oh no, it's right when I entered this? Okay, guys, I'm gonna, uh, do all this off camera and I will be back once I reach where I was previously. <laughs> oh my god! Ugh. All right, guys, I'm pretty much back to where I was. Uh, I got the winch thing set up, and I explored a lot, and I read all the stuff and things. And I actually saw some weird, like, creature run across the screen, but I wasn't recording at the time, but uh, it's pretty spooky. But anyway, um, I think I think I haven't actually been up these stairs yet, where this dead guy's at. So let's go up here and see if there's anything up here for us to do. Looks like there is. That was weird. Light that. Oh, I barely missed it. Got a magic genie lamp. Let's rub it. Eh. Okay, what's this? Uh, looks like Morse code deciphering. Shipment delay unacceptable. Forward immediately. Stop. Captain A. Lefever. End. Fancy. Any matches? Probably in here. Oh yeah. Yeah. There's like so many matches. It's like you don't need, you don't even have to worry about it. Honestly, they're they're pretty much everywhere. Ooh, we can do Morse code. Multiple deaths. Request reinforcements. Stop. Captain A. Lefever. End. Request reinforcement urgent. They were being overrun. Report death leg E. Dugois. Stop. Suspect native insurgents. Stop. Fort on combat alert. Stop. Captain A. End. 
Must report death leg, blah, blah, blah. Okay, people are dying. Everybody's dying. Oh, we got a bed. This is a... Wait, this is still a cot. Crap. It looked more like a legit bed because it's got a blanket on it. Okay, we're back outside. Looks like they buried some of their dead here. Like as he got up in here. Leave it a bloody revolution, eh? Oh, aye. Right, right, mate. Ernest Duguay. Duguay? Over here. I think this is a water pump. Ooh. Got a well or a reservoir of some kind? Okay, we got more matches if we need them later. Nice, nice. Okay, we're still looking for a bench. Or wood. We need a bed frame. Ooh. <laughs> I got an achievement called Narcissist because she looked I... in the water once. <laughs> I'm just not thirsty. I should be, I know, but I don't think I can stomach it. It's probably because you're dead. You're dead, lady. You're a psychopath. You've lost it. Alright, um. What the heck was that? You see that? Like, disappears when I get close to it. It's just gotta be a glitch. Le old glitches, yes? What is this? No entry without the authority of Captain Levifer. Levifer. Oh, we got a pathway, okay. Quartermaster only. Off limits. Stuck. Maybe. So we got that key. You think this key opens it? No? Huh. Alright. No, oh, okay. <laughs> I can't move this. Not on my own. Ah, uh, this is the one we gotta blow up, right? It's coming! It's coming! Through the gate! Come on! Move it! Oh, looks like I'm already pointed at it. <laughs> I'm just that good. <laughs> nice. Nice. Um, Gotta find that shell. We gotta find the arsenal, man. So we can go in there. Something glowing. More matches. Dude, matches for days. Okay, so that's locked. It won't open. You, oh, you think this is the arsenal? Oh, yeah. Making it happen, baby. Making waves. Making moves. It's Maka. <laughs> he is. Look. All right, guys, we're inside. We're inside. And yes, I did see that um, piece of paper. I'm just looking for things to light before my match runs out. All right, whatever. We got two things. That's good. February 10th, 29. Something shipment delivered. Blah, 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 blah. Four coils of blah, blah, blah. One crate of medicines here in the cage. See sergeant for access. Kill baby. I don't remember this place. It smells dead. It smells dead. Yes. It is so dead. Ooh, it's like some sort of press. Okay, cool. Oh, that's a reload of shell. Badass, dude. I get it. It's a reloader. 
If low on sulfur stock, check medicine supply for ointment of sulfur. Boil to extract. Not ideal. Makes powder mix unpredictable, but better than nothing. Ask Corporal blah 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 if in doubt. I believe him. Alright, so we gotta go find that medicine that I saw on the sheet, because that seemed important. Gunpowder mix, one cup of sulfur powder, one cup of milled charcoal, and eight cups of saltpeter. So we need sulfur, charcoal, and saltpeter. Okay. It's a big light. If low on stock, yeah, I talked to uh, talk to Corporal. What's his face? It's locked. Classic. Got six out of ten uh, matches. There's probably more in one of these, right? Yep. There we go. We got two more. <laughs> Uh, I ordered the saltpeter for tanning, not for your powder. I have moved it up to my stores, and there it stays. Requisition your own. Delacroix, the qu Okay, so it's in the quartermasters. So we need the quartermaster key. Uh, important, before you take the goods up to the main building, check Corporal Delacroix is available. The quartermaster must be present at all times to check the delivery. Do not leave boxes out in the sun. Okay, this might be a long episode, or I might have to just end the episode here early, because this is taking a while. Do not use on metal. Oil blade after use. Makes sense. Makes sense. We'll do a little more exploring before I end the episode here. Is this a tripwire? You see this? Are you seeing this? Am I gonna die? Did I jump this? Hit! Would that have killed me? It's like a giant crossbow, man. I don't know. Gotta be vigilant. You gotta have your eyes peeled for crap like that. Mother of God, what happened to you? I don't know, I can't see anything. Oh. Ooh. Yikes. Careful. Careful, this is rigged. Ooh. Some sort of trap. Yeah, I see that. Oh, it's a grenade. I see it right now. Yeah, 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 okay. Nice. I like. I like this. You hear that? The following items are off limits without authority of the captain, medicines, and strong spirits. The cage is not to be opened without a senior officer present. Nice. Nice. Uh, we got an 8 out of 10. Let's go ahead and take that matchbox. He gave us three, so we wasted one of them. That's okay. Chocolate. I don't need chocolate. I need charcoal, my dude. Oh, that went out fast. Oh, can we let the sunlight in? Can we jump to our death? Oh, do we gotta go outside? Be for real, we gotta go on the balcony here. Okay, we gotta be careful. Be careful. Maybe this isn't such a great idea. Eh, eh. Dude, we are so beefy. We're the beefiest woman in the world. What was the point of this? I don't understand. Just to let more light inside? 
I don't know. Anyway, let's go explore more of this place. What's that? Chuck. Oh, charcoal, baby. Okay, we got one out of the three items. Nice. Do we have to put it inside here? Okay, we put it inside. Let's close that. So we're making charcoal powder now, right? Yeah, milled charcoal. Fine char charcoal powder milled in the arsenal. I know how to make weaponry, man. I know how to make ammunitions. Ooh. We are seriously the beefiest pregnant lady in the history of pregnant ladies. Okay, is that all there was in here? Do not remove the tools. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Okay, we've done what we need to do in here. All right? Will this kill me? Hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna trip this. Shit! <sighs> oh no, I'm so afraid! Oh no! Oh no! That was very scary. I totally didn't see that coming. Not at all. Not at all. Oh, wait, there's a window over there. <laughs> we gotta jump that gap. Okay, we'll close that. That's lame. Okay, here we go. I mean, we are the beefiest woman in the world, so... We've done it! We've done it! Ain't no thang but a chicken wang. Okay. I did see the stuff on the table, by the way. Don't worry about it. I'm just checking around. If I'm lucky, there's no element of sulfur. Perfect. Laudanum. Hey, that's the stuff that I'm on. It says, do not use in children under one years old or during pregnancy. Well then. Bummer. Because <laughs> I just used it at the beginning. And we have laudanum. It says don't use it if you're pregnant, so... Not gonna do it. And we got sulfur ointment. Nice. So we got two out of the three items, and there is something up here. Uh, to those who come after us, I have failed. We tried to die in defiance, but those devils will not allow it. The screaming does not stop. I cannot shut it out. I cannot bear it. They treat my men as a cruel child treats a puppy, reveling in the joy of the pain, and they watch me all the while. Alderic keeps crying my name. Gardener has stopped breathing. He is the lucky one. Suicide is a sin, but the Lord has deserted us, and I will not give these demons their satisfaction. So here, I take my stand and make my death on my own terms. I pray you, do not tell my uh, Oralee of this fate. Tell her... Uh, we died in some glorious, noble purpose, and that I was a father to be proud of. She has done nothing to deserve this hurt. Signed deal, Captain Augustine liveth her. Can we take this nade? Oh! Can I not take the nade? Fine. Seriously? I feel like that would be super... Super easy. Barely an inconvenience, in fact. More laudanum? How much of that do I need? Because I feel like I could use this grenade to maybe get to the radio. I may be the, uh, the most beefy, strong woman in the world, but I ain't the smartest, I'll tell you that. Alright, can we open this? 
No, it's still locked. No, 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 no. No thing, we're okay. I guess I could have just hid behind this. <laughs> I mean, I might have uh, hearing damage, but you know, no problem, no problem. Ew, nasty. Ooh, it blew a hole in this thing. Damn, that was brutal. We need sulfur powder. How do I make the powder? Okay, I'm a genius. Don't worry about it. It's bubbling. It's bubbling. How long is that gonna take? Bubbling has ceased. Ooh! Bada bing, bada boom, baby! Don't worry about it, capiche? Don't worry about it. All right, now we need uh, the stuff and the things. We need uh, the salt peter. Eight cups of it, in fact. All right, how the hell do we get in this quartermaster place, though? Is this seriously gonna work? So this whole time, you guys, I thought I actually had to get items that would go in my inventory. But I think you can just place a piece of wood here. Oh my god, are you serious? That took me like a half an hour or more. <laughs> uh. Could I get into the radio room from above somehow? Alright, well we've done it! We've done it! I'm so scared, oh my god, no. Spooky hand stole my, uh, my lantern juice. Oh, we got a cannon. Nice, 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 nice. What's this? Oh. Another light, beautiful. Another light, lovely. Got a locked door, classic. Wait, is that a wheel? Hold on. Oh, dude, check it! It's not going anywhere on two wheels. On two wheels. It's not going anywhere on two wheels. Flippin' sluts. <laughs> nah, they're just having fun, man. They're just having fun. Alright, um... Okay, she's naked. Well, she's got her boobies hanging out. That ain't cool, bruh. Nothing? Whoa, this is a lot to read. 13th of March, 1929, deputation from the Kelhanan. Further complaints of behavior of Legio, Solorites, and Desrosiers around the women. Acknowledged complaint. Assurance it will not be repeated. Ordered punishment, but not in front of locals. Apparent that the men need some activity to keep them occupied. I have given orders to start evacu uh, to evacuation of the lower chambers. Please don't stop. Uh, men have broken through to an underground chamber. Impressive architecture. Rubble to be cleared, and then evaluation of the site. The corporal reports activity on lower slopes. Speculates retaliation from the village, but hard to believe. Guard has been doubled. 
Uh, De La Croix and Das Rossiers absent. Sarger Four in the Air believes them to be hiding in the cistern. Corporal Khalid found Des Rossiers in the cellar, dead. No sign of De La Croix. Suspect argument, accidental killing, and desertion. Oh my god. 22nd of March. Incident in cistern. Legio Duguay has been killed. Men report animal attack. They are jumping at shadows. Every noise is hailed as lion or jackal. Sergeant Fournier suspects Kel Hanan are responsible. Fort placed on alert will lead search for cistern. All right, so I got to find the cistern that's under this place. All right, we got some... Uh some lantern juice, aka oil. Oh, it's a large one. Nice. Nice. I did it. <gasps> it's just rude, dude. What are you doing? Mind your own business. Flipping dick. Alright. Oh, it's still locked. Okay. Okay, so we got one wheel. We need to get another wheel. Yikes. Okay, where is the other wheel? But what was it? What did you see? Miss Triana? I, uh... I, I don't know. It was just a shadow. Yes, Min? A ghoul. It was a ghoul. A ghoul. The good captain, he has to play the fair-minded statesman. Pretend the Kelhanan are more than savages. Give them the benefit of the doubt. He is an ass. That lot up at Tezempt are worse than the Bedouin. Even the Tuareg do not trust him. Or trust them. I remember the stories Maxime told. They skinned two of Albert's troop. Left them there to die, screaming, salt rubbed into the flesh. All in the name of this great mother of theirs. They put on pretty smiles and give the captain painted rocks. But they're the worst of devils. They aren't so many. Slaughter them and make excuses later. If I were commander, maybe we'll do it anyway. Damn, brutal, dude. Brutal on all accounts. Dude, we're getting so much flippin' uh, oil, my, my dudes. It's oil city up in here. Okay, um, gotta find that other wheel. Got one. That's the room I was just in. This floor doesn't look too sturdy. Dude, so much oil. Got more matches, we're at four. I should probably start using the lantern now, honestly. There's so much flipping juice. Okay, so I'm guessing we gotta push the... ...cannon over here. I hope the batteries don't run out. Can we steal a wheel? Cannot steal a wheel. Okay, we need we need one that's loose. On the floor. There we go. We've done it! But before we go... Let's get all the stuff and the things. Oh, the gun's broken. No! These guys are all dead. These poor bastards didn't die fighting. Look at this chap here. Suicide. Why? Suicide. Why would they do that? Look, what's this? 
Hey, mod girl. Wait, you're anywhere, mate. Once again, the beefiest woman in the world. The beefiest pregnant woman in the world. We're super strong. Yeah, I guess we're heading down. Oh, it is dark and there is something running around uh, around down here. Oh, there we go. <gasps> he dead. Some and he dead. Like these people. Everybody dead. Okay, we finally made it to the radio room, guys. Good lord. Hello? Hello, doctor, are you there? Yes, yes, I'm here. Ava, is that you? Oh. Thank God, it's Tazi, Tazi Trianon. Miss Trianon, Tazi, uh, are you well? Yes, well, no, not really, not at all. I, ca I can't remember anything. I'm pregnant, I'm lost. S S Selim, a fort, I'm in a fort. We were here before, I think. I don't know. Doctor. Where are you? We have found help. People, a village. But, uh, Yasmin, she's not well. The fort. Yes, the fort. Go through the mountain pass, and it is maybe an hour beyond there. The mountain pass? Yes, yes, I see the village here on the map. Oh, thank God. But, um, Doctor, please, there's something else. I, uh, I keep blacking out. It, it feels like I'm losing control. I am aware of your recent problems, Miss Triana. In fact, must get help. Doctor? As quick as you can. There may still be a chance. Doctor! Doctor Metzier! Damn. Damn it. Dude, that? The town. Village? A town? The doctor said it was through the pass. Here, on the map. That's far away. I just need to find my way to that. I mean, it looks far away according to the map. Damn. Alright, well. We were about to find out why we're blacking out in total psycho, but, uh... Radio flipped out. Okay, what did we get in our inventory? We got the radio? Oh, cool. Alright, can we find the key to the one dude's place? Is there anything else down here? I don't think so, right? Dead and gone. Can't hurt you now. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Jonathan, look out! Oh! <laughs> the door! Get to the door! Everyone! What do we... What do we do? Liz! The keys! Lock the damn door! Spirky! Come here, little buddy. Where you at, homie? Just wanna play. Wanna have a little buddy to play with. Maybe he maybe he'd make a nice pet. Ooh, he lost his head, man. <gasps> Salt Peter! It was in this box. It was in this flipping box. We're getting close. <gasps> Quartermaster's stores, baby. Salt Peter, baby. Open. Oh my god. 
Missing supplies will be treated as theft. Yeah, you can suck it. We gotta find a way in there. We gotta find that key, man. Totes adorbs. All right. That didn't take long to load. Oh, okay. That's... Chill out. <sighs> Fuck. Oh. I think... I think it stopped. Can we go back in? I'm scared. Gotta get that, uh, gotta get that salt, Peter. Oh yeah, baby. Ooh. Nice, loads pretty quick. Okay, now that that guy stopped having a little tissy fit. Got two more matches, we got eight. Nice. It's locked, classic, classic. So so flipping dark, man. If you wish to have something issued from the store, apply to Corporal De La Croix. Do not take them yourself. Okay, we gotta find a way in that damn store. Sounds like it's eating. It's feeding. It's eating something. Oh. Oh, it must have came out of here. That makes sense. Okay, cool. That's what it Salt Peter! No, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here, darling. Get some more matches before we do, though. Is it gonna be here and it's gonna be trying to get me? I'm on my toes. I'm expecting something scary. Sit, 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 sit. Pick your neck. I can make it. Get them through. It's coming. It's coming. Move it, Come on. Move it. Malik. Now I got down and get over here. <laughs> into the pass. Nice. All right, let's go make that shell and then blow that gate up. We're out of this biznitch. Do the kids still say that? Probably not. Probably not. All righty. Salt Peter. Load her up. Got a shell. Let's get out of here. So far, I still have all my fingers. Good job, Head doll. Right out, I guess. Who's that little one? Kitty cat. Not so kitty? I uh, gotta be honest, I don't really see it. Well, good job, little lady. Good job. Alright, I'm gonna be happy to, to get out of here finally. Now I don't have hearing protection, so I'm probably gonna go deaf. 
but that's okay. Wait, how do we... How do we load this bad boy? Or we gotta secure it in place, right? I gotta do, lady. Alright, how do we... How do we... How do we load it? There we go. Was it loaded? Alright, let's do it. Fall down into the cistern below? My god. <laughs> awesome. Anyway, guys, uh, this has been a long ass episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, if you did, a thumbs up and a subscription would be most excellent. And I will see you fine folks in the next one.